Hello, you're yeah, welcome back to Adota Farm. Uh, here we teach you a lot of things you need to know about farming and I uh, will give you some necessary information so that you, uh, no one misleads you. So uh, today I'll be telling you this, uh, if there is side effects in fleeting your pond, like when you use chemical to fleet your pond, is there any side effects? So there is no side effect. Currently there is no side effect for anything like using chemical to fleet your pond to kill all the grasses and every other thing in the pond so you can use your chemical so far you are not pouring the whole cylinder into the pond so there is no side effect for spraying your pond so the thing is the volume of the uh, diluted chemical you are using to fleet your pond is not equivalent to the volume of the water inside the pond so the the, the volume of the water inside the pond is much more than the volume of your diluted chemical so you understand so there is no side effects for that so uh, so far you are not pouring the whole cylinder into the pond so you have no problem you can fleet your pond we've been doing this for many years and we have no problem doing it so it's not new and uh, this is not just a new system it's what we've been doing years after years as you can see the farm is clean we still want to uh, spray another one so that uh, all the grass can still die so we don't if you don't want your farm bushy and if you want to save your strength so do uh, brushing and cutting grasses is natural using cutlass to cut it is very is natural but uh, using machine is very easier so that is why we we prefer using machine so we prefer using the spray machine to the spraying tank to spray the distance so far there is no um side effect so this one is very fast and uh, it can even save our time as well so we can have time to do other things so that is just the simplest things i want you to know so it, there is no side effect if you are using chemical to fleet your pond so you understand so don't don't let anyone mislead you so you can get all the necessary information here please don't forget i am your farm, farm captain don't forget to subscribe and uh, don't forget to share don't forget to like and drop a comment if there is anything you are confused about a droplet like it's a droplet that is going to drop inside the uh, pond just a droplet from the um, spraying tank so you don't need to be confused so yeah it's, it's, it's the pond is already stuck and that is how I've been spraying it right from day one that will stock the fish so don't be scared <laughs> your fish are not going to die nothing will happen to your fish so fear you're not going to uh, focus on spraying the water alone spraying the water you, you are there to spray the the grasses so spraying the grasses and the, the the only thing that will only happen is the just little drop of the chemical will drop into the water so you don't need to be scared you don't need to fear there is no side effect we've been doing it years after years and nothing happened to our fish no it's just it, everything depends on the way you handle your farm so if you handle your farm with uh, cares and you know how you do your things nothing will go wrong in your farm so it's just a droplet that is going to drop into the water so a lot of people are scared of using chemicals to um to 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 spray into their pond so where which is uh do some people just prefer prefer using the hand hand is natural like i said the other time so it's not a bad idea using hand and it's not, it's not a bad idea using your chemical as well so this one is very fast and it is it is very swift so if you want to do it so you can actually use chemical to spray your pond and there is no side effect about it so you get so just spray your spray your pond measure make sure you get uh, measure the right quantity into your spraying tank and spray the area that you needed to spray even if, if you if you should get something if i should tell you some secret if you mentioned uh, uh the if you measure this uh this uh chemical and uh, you pour it inside the spraying tank and it's not enough the content you mentioned is not enough so compared to the water to the water you put in the tank to the liters of the water in the tank so it won't work on grasses that is just what that is just the simple logic i wanted to understand so if you if you are spraying your if you measure uh, your chemical into your uh water and into your tank and you diluted them so and you are spraying your pond so if the the droplet if it drop into the uh, into your pond so it has nothing to do because the water in the pond is higher than the droplet of that uh chemical so it has nothing to do to your fish 
So spray your fish anytime, anywhere, any way, any anyhow you just feel like. But make sure your focus is to spray the grass on the dike alone.